We're learning more tonight about the deadly airplane crash in Ohio County that left an instructor and student dead late Wednesday night. That's right, WBK's Presley Allen attended the press conference up in Ohio County today and has more on what the National Transportation Safety Board is saying about their investigation so far. It's breaking news now at 6. I'm here at the Ohio County Courthouse where a press conference was just held in regards to the deadly plane crash that happened in Ohio County on Wednesday night. The debris field is said to be around 40 acres, so teams are still investigating the area. Between now and what we find out tomorrow night, whether there's a government shutdown, get all the factual information documented. If there's not, then probably within about 10 to 15 days, we will have a preliminary report come out. After that, and we do our detailed investigation, our final reports can take up to about 16 to 18 months before they're published. There's a lot of information that has to be analyzed. We may look at some parts of the aircraft structural wise, we may not, but gathering all this weather information, pilot qualifications and interviews, it can take a while. One of the parts of the plane that is still missing is half of the elevator. Debris and parts of the airplane that have been found will be taken to Springfield, Tennessee to be further investigated. Reporting from Davis County, this is Presley Allen with WBKO News.